Today on MTG Unpacked, it's time for a double dose of chaos. That's right, we're cracking open two MTG Unpacked chaos mystery boxes. So these things are my vision for how a chaos mystery box should be. Let's introduce the patrons. We have Eric Polanco and Emblazoned Aegis. Okay, so we're going to roll one through three. Um, actually, no, we're just going to roll one through nine. So we have 11. That's not going to do it. Five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so that one goes to Eric. I wish I had picked a better dice now, but anyway, 15, 8. Do we have 8? Yes, this one here. Perfect. Alright, so that wasn't as bad as I thought it could be. Let's move these aside and get stuck into it. And shout out to Jay Shing. I think he would have burst if this video was any later than it was. So you'll see why momentarily. So thank you for being a patron, Eric. Let's get into it. And there is a very cool theme this month. I think it might be surprising to a lot of people. We have Modern Horizons Core 2020. Okay, 2021. Ooh, there we are. You know what the theme is now? Armenket and Hour of Devastation Invocations. Okay, so we've got 21 guilds, Theros and Throneville Drain. Let's go with something like this. And check out this sweet foil here. These are some of my favorite cards here, which I actually don't own that many, so the patrons are getting a lot more than I have right now. We have Mind Twist. Target player discards X cards at random, so it's a sorcery for X and a black. It's very difficult to read, but I still think it's cool. I started playing in the Armenket days. So enjoy, Eric. Let's get into it. Any patrons get the rares, mythic foils, and anything over a buck. And I think he actually scored the best card there, although there could be others. There could be others if my memory fails me. All right, we have Kelden Raider, Aerial Assault, Sage's Row Denizen, Reduced to Ashes, Feral Abomination, Mammoth Spider Murder, Netcaster Spider. Undead Servant, Chandra's Embercat, and Uncommon's Warden of Evos Isle, Diviner's Lockbox, Yarox Fenloka, and the rare is Dungeon Geists. Creature Spirit 3 3 for 4 with flying, so when it enters battlefield, tap target creature and opponent controls. That creature doesn't untap during its controller's untap step for as long as you control Dungeon Geists. And a Windscarred Crag and Wolf Token, and this reminds me, I need to do a uh, Battle at some point between Core 2020 and Core 2021. I think that would be pretty interesting. Next up, we have a Weaselbat Redcap Creature Goblin Knight. Nice. Prized Griffin. We do love the goblins here, in case you hadn't guessed. Mantle of Tides. Reaper of Night. Return to Nature. Golden Egg. Tool as a Beanstalk. Vantress Paladin. Idyllic Grange. Lockthrain Gargoyle, and Uncorn's Shambling Suit, Grumgully the Generous Legendary Creature, Goblin Shaman, Bog Naughty, and a Mythic, nice, Embercleave. Legendary Artifact Equipment for six has Flash, the spell costs one less cast for each attacking creature you control. When it enters the battlefield, attach it to target creature you control, equip creature gets plus one, plus one, and has double strike and trample. Equip it for three, very nice indeed, a mountain. And a rat token. I'll put the rat in as well because rats and goblins are some of my favorite things. Let's move on here. Theros. Looks like a Japanese pack with the pull tab and reverse order. We have a wolf token, a mountain, and oh, a foil rare. Okay, treacherous blessing, enchantment for three. So when it enters battlefield, draw three cards. Whenever you cast a spell, you lose one life. And when it becomes the target of spell ability, sacrifice it. Let's get some more lighting there. Fantastic. A second rare. Heliod's intervention. Instant for X and two white. Choose one. Destroy X target artifacts and or enchantments. Or target player gains twice X life. And uncommons. Grey Merchant of Asphodel. Dream Shaper Shaman. Elspeth's Nightmare. And the Commons Arena Trickster Satyr's Cunning. Ichthyomorphosis, you have been fish, sir. Sorry about that. 
Captivating Unicorn, Warbriar Blessing, War Omen of the Hunt, Mogus's Favor, Bronze Sword, and Gift of Strength. We are still trying to figure out what you are, sir. If you have any good guesses, leave a note in the comments. I know people have been guessing for months now. I'm not sure if we've come close to an understanding of that strange beast. Okay, guilds, let's go for some shocks here. We have Take Heart. Radical idea, ornery goblin, creature goblin warrior, severed strands, wild ceratoc, whisper agent, candlelight vigil, sonic assault, a bit like my voice, isn't it, rhizome lurcher, fresh face recruit, uncommons lava coil, beam splitter mage, district guide, and where is venerated loxodon, creature elephant cleric, 4-4 for four, four, 5 with convoke, and when it ends Spadeful, put a plus one plus one counter on each creature that convoked it. The Golgari Gilgate and Elf Knight. And I think it was probably a missed opportunity. I should have got hold of some uh, Armanket and Hour of Dev packs for these uh, boxes. But, alas, I think they're getting a little bit ridiculously expensive at this point. Okay, we have Cancel. Thrill of Possibility. Revitalize. Opt. Colossal Dreadmore. Lenny Island's Steward, Return to Nature, Grasp of Darkness, Teferi's Protege, Hunter's Edge, and Uncommon's Chrome Replicator, Leafkin Avenger, Fierce Empath, and a Mythic! Nice! Teferi Master of Time! Fantastic pool, Legendary Planeswalker, Teferi, 3 loyalty for 4. So you may activate loyalty abilities of Teferi Master of Time on any player's turn, any time you could cast an instant craziness. Is plus one, draw a card, then discard a card, minus three, target creature you don't control, phases out. Minus ten, take two extra turns after this one. This is insane. And they've got uh, different artworks for these. I think there's like maybe half a dozen or a dozen different variants. And a swamp and angel token. I'll chuck that in as well. That's pretty cool. Okay, Modern Horizons up next. We are looking for Ren and Stimpy. And we will be having an entire episode with the previous box where we went through the misprints. We got a ton of misprints out of that box, so stay tuned for that video coming soon. Okay, we've got an illusion. Uh, Prismatic Vista, yes! Snow Covered Swamp. And the rare is... Oh, a foil rare! Okay, and Ling. Creature, Zombie Shapeshifter 3-3 three, three for 4. So you either pay black, give it menace until end of turn, death touch, or undying. Or you can pay one, give it plus one, minus one, or minus one, plus one until end of turn. Okay, and your second rare is Nurturing Peatland. Nice. So land, tap, pay one life, add black or green, pay one, tap, suck it, draw a card. And uncommon Smiting Helix, Tempered Sliver. King of the Pride and Commons Winter's Rest, Putrid Goblin Creature, Zombie Goblin, Elvish Fury, Pure Hibbit, Glutinous Slug, The Ruiner of Livestreams, Frostwaller, I Kite, Goblin War Party, and oh, Wall of 1000 Cuts, one more card there. Alright, so enjoy, Eric. I think you have done fantastically well for yourself today, sir. Some absolutely crazy pulls there, we'll pop those in here. Okay, next up, Emblazoned Aegis. Thank you for being a patron. What craziness will we find in here? Any guesses now that you've seen what the theme is? Let me know in the comments section. Okay, prop that over there. Okay, we've got Modern Horizons, Core 2021, Guilds. Ooh, we'll take a look at that in a moment. Throne of All Drain, Core 2021, and Ikoria. Okay, so let's bookend things here with the Core 2021. Take a look at this spicy foil here. The Scorpion God. Legendary Creature God. I'm having a real hard time reading this. Um, it's for three, black and red, I believe. Whenever a creature with a one... Minus one, minus one, count on it dies, draw a card for one black and a red. Put a minus one, minus one, counter on another target creature. And when the Scorpion God dies, return it to its owner's hand at the beginning of the next end step. Okay, isn't that fantastic when you can read it? Yeah. Um, the lighting, it's sort of a 
dim and dark card, but there we go. Enjoy Emblazoned Aegis and Invocation. Is there anyone out there who actually collects those things still? Leave a note in the comments. Okay, next up, Core 2021. We have Thrill of Possibility, Valorous Steed, Read the Tides, Destructive Tampering, Village Rights, Satessan Training, Chandra's Magma, Swift Response, Wall of Runes, Uncommon Sanctum of Stone Fangs, Tempered Veteran, Battle Rattle Shaman, Creature Goblin Shaman, and Rare is Thieves Guild Enforcer. Creature Human Rogue, 1-1 one, one for a single black, has Flash, so when it or another rogue enters the battlefield under your control, each opponent mills two cards. As long as an opponent has eight or more cards in their graveyard, Thieves Guild Enforcer gets plus two, plus one, and has Death Touch. And a foil rare, Speaker of the Heavens. Creature, human cleric, 1-1 one, one for a single white, Vigilance and Lifelink. Tap it, create a 4-4 white angel creature token with flying. Activate the ability only if you have at least seven life more than your slaying life total, and any time you could cast a sorcery, a dismal backwater, and sapling token. On to Ikoria, looks like a Japanese pack here, so we'll crack that open. Ooh, nice one! You get a Kraken token! I'll throw that in as well. A Plains, and a Savai Triome! Holy moly, this video is craziness! So land, Mountain Plain, Swamp, tap it for red, white, or black, enter Spadefield, tap, cycle it for three, good deal. Uncommons, Rogan Crystal, Migration Path, Regal, Leosaur, and the Commons, Wilt, Unlikely Aid, Adventurous Impulse, Gloom, Pangolin, Phase Dolphin, Checkpoint Officer, Mutual Destruction, Migratory Great Horn, Forbidden Friendship, and Lurking Deadeye. On to some guilds, maybe this time we'll get a shop land. Wouldn't that be fantastic? I mean, I'm being a little bit greedy at this point, but you know, good to get some crazy pulls here. We have Leapfrog, Fearless Halberdier, Sworn Companions, Barrier of Bones, Centaur Peacemaker, Dark Blade Agent, Devious Cover Up, Erswile Trooper, Sky Knight Legionnaire, and Uncommon's Chemist is inside, Crush Contraband. Legion Guild Mage, and yes, Overgrown Tomb, yes, it's a land, Swamp Forest. Tap up for black or green as it ends the battlefield, you may pay two life, if you don't, it ends the battlefield tapped. We are firing on all cylinders today, people, and a foil Boros Challenger with a Demir Guildgate and Elf Knight token. Okay, onward to Eldraino. So maybe we can pull an Oko or something like that. We get a Misford River Turtle, Weaselback Red Cap Creature, Goblin Knight, Fairy Guide Mother, Queen of Ice, Curious Pair, Lost Legion, Fierce Witch Stalker, Jousting Dummy, Scorching Dragonfire, Wildwood Tracker, Once and Future for the Uncommons, Cauldron Familiar, um, I'll put him in. I think he might have been creeping up in price, Rampart Smasher. And rare is Mirror Maid. Enchantment 3. You may have Mirror Maid enter battlefield as a copy of any artifact or enchantment on the battlefield. They planes and a Garrick Curse Huntsman emblem. I'll check that in as well. Core 2021. So what do you think of these sets so far? And which one do you like better? Core 2020 or 2021? Leave a note in the comments. We have Secure the Scene. Cancel. Hobble Fiend, Blood Glutton, Track Down, Gale Swooper, Life Goes On, Wishcoin Crab, Spell Gorge A Weird, Cage Zombie, that's pretty cool, Uncommon's Hellkite Punisher, Cultivate, um, okay, I don't think that's over a buck anymore, Enthralling Hold, and rare is Feline Sovereign, Creature Cat 2 3 for 3, looking very regal there. Other cats you control get plus one, plus one, and have protection from dogs. That's hilarious. Whenever one or more cats you control deal combat damage to a player, destroy up to one target artifact or enchantment that player controls. Dogs beg, cats lay claim. Yes, indeed, they do. Ooh, and a nice swamp here. I'll chuck that in. An MTG Arena token. And I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button for more Magic Gathering unboxings. And be sure to tap notification bell to be notified as soon as new video is released. Okay, we have an Illusion Non-Foil. Sissé. Snow-Covered Forest. 
And we will slow roll things here. Okay, let's check out the uncommons. We got Soul Herder, I think that's over a buck still. Splice's Skill, Ravenous Giant. And the commons, Crozan Tusker, Return from Extinction, Windcaller Avon, Pyrophobia, Segovian Angel, Changeling Outcast, Rhyme Tender, Goblin Champion, Creature Goblin Warrior, Reprobation, and Spinehorn Minotaur. Okay, let's hope for a big finish here. What's it gonna be? Hall of Heliod's Generosity. Wah, 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 wah. Okay, I mean, it's it's not the greatest, but anyway. Legendary Land, tapped, add Colors Mana, pay one. White, tap, put target and chump card from your graveyard on top of your library. Okay, so we had some crazy pulls today. Enjoy that emblazoned Aegis. Thank you for being a patron once again. I hope everyone's staying safe and healthy out there. Thanks for watching and have a great day.